Let the drama begin! It's on like Donkey Kong. DDG finally collabed with Ash. It's Illuminati's ex-girl. Okay, listen, if y'all been following that drama of theirs, Illuminati don't like DDG. DDG don't like Illuminati. When Ash and Illuminati first broke up, DDG messaged her and asked her to do a collab with him. Obviously, you know for what reason, you know, it's to piss off Illuminati. And sure enough, Ash was still loyal to his ass and chose not to do it. But now, time has passed. They've been separated. There's no friends with benefits no more. There's no attachment anymore. So Illuminati's talking shit about her still, saying how she's over here showing her body now, like she's got a page, a fans only page, and she's selling herself and blah, 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 blah. And Ash is saying like, fuck it. You know what? I'ma collab with this motherfucker now. You wanna act dumb? I'ma collab with him. I don't owe you loyalty no more. I'm here for it, y'all. First things first. We all know that DDG does skits, okay? Most of his stuff is fake. Y'all know how YouTube works. Ash doesn't do that. Ash doesn't do the skit thing. I don't know if this video is gonna be real or not. I don't know if he's gonna fuck with her head and then just film it, or they have this as a skit and they're just collabing it that way. So let's go ahead and watch. This video is called, I told Ash I like her and this happened. Okay, let's watch. You look really nice today. Thanks. Really, really nice. I feel the vibe. <laughs> Official merch is now live. You can scroll it down. Right. All right, let's Hurry get through up. all let's that. Get let's get it. This or no? So this is what people have been doing lately. They tell the girls come to the back just to What's see their reaction. Good, YouTube? Welcome back to another video, and in today's video, I have a special guest. Hi. What's <laughs> up? Nothing much. I'm chilling. Out here bored. Yeah? Mm-hmm. No, deadass, I've been in LA for like five days now. Mm -hmm. It's so boring. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I had a lot of fun this week, though. I'm chilling. Relaxing, you know. How you been, though? You chilling? Yes. <laughs> What's the topic of the... The topic of this mukbang? Well, you ain't tell me your name. You know my name. No, you didn't tell them your oh, name. Yeah, girl, yeah. not everybody knows you. Oh, 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 yeah. Introduce yourself, girl. Say, I'm Saluminati's ex-girlfriend. Then they'll know who you are. Uh, okay, I'm such a bad YouTuber. Don't sub to me. If you're under 21, I wouldn't recommend it. Really? Why? Because I cuss sometimes and stuff. I'll be cussing too. These niggas grown. Okay, well, anyways, I'm Ash or Ashley, whatever. My channel's Ash. Sorry. I was thinking. I forgot. Yeah, people don't know who I am. I told you he was inside. Look. I'm gonna huh? kill his ass. Oh, I don't like killing bugs. So, right now, we're eating some. Uh, we're eating Chick fil A. Mac and cheese. Mac and cheese. I, I wasn't gonna get this, and then I seen it. And she pointed it out, and I was like, you know what? I'm gonna try it, cause usually I don't eat mac and cheese like that. But it bang, it slaps. Mm -hmm. Highly recommend it. Really good. <laughs> How's your day been, Ash? Whack and lame. Really? Yeah, it's so boring. It but still? honestly, it's the holiday season, so like I forgot about that. Is it still whack, even though you're kicking it with me? Or? No, it's gotten funner. It's gotten yes. a lot funner. Okay, okay. W. Okay. This guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I be seeing on your channel or whatever, you be like... I can't wait to see Saluminati's um, reaction to this video. He's gonna say something. He's the type that always speaks his mind regardless of what you think. So, I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna be so excited to see what he has to say. You be like, reading. <coughs> Excuse me. Energy. It's, it's like you're like hella spiritual. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. I don't read energy, but... <sighs> <laughs> like what could you tell me something about myself oh she ain't a psychic not necessarily but i know someone who can because i have a life coach and she's like an energy reader and she could literally look at you and tell you shit about yourself really yes i got the heart on my phone right now but the relevancy of myself in this video i wouldn't and then my channel you know what i mean i was saying if you can read me like 
You don't know how to like read palms or no shit like that? No. no. Where'd don't you don't get that from? I don't have my bio or nothing. Right, where'd you Did get I, that maybe from? Because my hair is purple, like the orb yeah. emoji. You thought that? <laughs> is that why? It's probably a thing on your lip. Oh yeah, this is a meditation symbol. Um, really? Mm-hmm. So it's like, because I've been hearing about it. People think Ash is dumb and stupid, and she actually is not. She's highly intelligent. She has degrees. Uh, she's actually served in the Navy. I believe it's the Navy. So she's very highly intelligent. She just believes in spiritual spirituality and meditation, and she's into like the third eye and all that type of stuff. So people think she's crazy because of it. She's not. She just thinks outside the box. Lately, uh, being in touch with your higher self. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> if y'all don't know, she be doing like, she be talking about stuff like that on her channel. Y'all wanna check that out. I hate the term higher self though, because then it's like a reiteration of a separation. Like you're not there yet, yeah. you know? Really? I don't even feel like we're talking about the same thing. No. I don't know. Why did our mind so off? Ask me something. I want you to get to know me. Okay. Um. Ask me the good shit that they want to hear. Just straight to it. Let the good out. shit? Like uh, what though? Juicy. Oh, those those internet things. Okay. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> okay. Um, oh no. What you gonna ask, girl? What you gonna ask? Just ask it. Do you masturbate? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, that's <laughs> uh, only yeah, ask, like, yo. What are you right? That, you think so how was that internet stuff? <laughs> People want to hear that? I think so. Y'all want to know that? Hey. <laughs> I mean, I don't nobody knows. That's a question that nobody knows the answer to. Only you do, DDG. Go ahead and answer. I don't understand a lot of people, but I'm pretty so, sure. So was you, was you, that's like the first thing that came to your head, but. No. Do I masturbate? <laughs> <laughs> I, I think every, listen, I'm gonna answer like this. I think every nigga do. Why not? You know? Of course, I believe so. I believe so too. Everybody whack their shit. That's what we gotta do. Yeah, there. How's that for your juicy question? Yeah, there anymore. Because you said juicy, so I'm like, fuck. I had actually prepared a list of nine questions to ask uh, somebody of significance or importance or somebody that even someone would like give a fuck to hear their response to like you know that's in like a high level of status or stature or whatever like monetary gain wise but I don't have the flashcards but the first one was are you happy? Yeah. Good question. I would say that. That's actually it's a simple question, but it's a really great question. People with power and with money, people automatically assume that they're happy. That's not necessarily true. That's why there's so many suicidal rates and amongst those people. So really answer the question, DDG. That's a good question. That's a very good question. I would say that I'm happy. I would say that I'm on the way to being at my happiest. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Not all the way there yet. You know, some shit fucked me up. You know what I'm saying? But then, like, every day I'm getting closer and closer. Dang, that's cool. That's a good... That's a good answer, huh? Mm -hmm, that's a bomb-ass answer. <laughs> the second one is, are you healthy? Very healthy. Hey. I'm sure as hell I'm not. I don't exercise, I don't eat well, I eat a lot of fast food, I don't drink enough water. <clears throat> and I know I should be doing all that because that will help um, better my situation with my depression. But it's so hard to be, it's so hard to stay motivated. The one thing I don't do, I'm not very consistent in the gym. Neither am I. But at the same <laughs> time, it's like, I'm still slim. Yeah. Yeah, I wish I was actually this one, but it's okay. I mean, eventually, it's like usually on and off points in life, you'll get into the gym and then stop or yeah. whatever. Yeah. Anyways, health is important. It is. Sorry. It helps uh, your mental uh, health as well. your psychological health? What is that? Great question. Mental. <laughs> Next Good. question. I think my head is screwed on very, very, very tight. I'm like very, very work savvy. My work ethic is unstoppable. No matter what happens, I'm gonna always keep working. Damn, that's good. Yeah, I can't stop working for some reason. Sometimes I wanna stop, but I can't. I'm not like that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this. 
she's telling the truth. She does. She really is not like that. She doesn't believe in working. She doesn't believe in working for the man. She feels that um, you should only work for yourself. And that's why she's in the situation she's in right now. She's highly in debt and living at her cousin's house. And I don't think she has a car still. So, but <laughs> uh, even though she's financially unstable, she seems to believe that that doesn't create happiness, that um, living freely does. That's true, though. That's good. I like this question. What's the next one? Let me think. The next one was, oh, um, what, what keeps you going every day? What's your motivation? Keeps me going every day. I would say my family, um, not to sound corny, but my fans. Family and fans, please. And then I have 4.2. Do you think that's like your purpose? Which kind of doesn't make sense. My purpose is It does make sense. It does make sense. Would I do it for? Or I don't know. Yeah, I know. You didn't really like... It does make sense, Ash. He said family and fans. So what is your purpose? Maybe with fans, it would be um, ins inspiring them, inspiring other people. I would say that's an example of your purpose. Answer it the way that would have made sense, but I forgot the, the other five questions. Well, yeah. Let me ask you, are you happy? Mm -hmm. Of course not. You so? Yeah, I'm just bored a lot of the time, but happy, yeah. That's good. <laughs> yeah. I don't think she's happy. Really good. Uh -huh. Can I ask you another question? Mm -hmm. Not off topic. Oh no. There is no clear topic here. You're right. Wait. Oh no. What are you... Are you attracted to me? Be 100. Oh, oh my god. Um... I would be so turned off. Like if, if DDG was a woman and I'm about to collab with you because I'm trying to make friends and trying to grow my business. And just because you're gay, I'm gay, you're gonna ask me if I'm attracted to you. I'm not here for this, but you're doing it for clout. He's obviously trolling. Mm, I don't wanna like, try to like curve you on your YouTube. Oh! You no. <laughs> well, but like, I just don't trust my, I just, I just, I just d like, no, but I wanna say yes, cause that's like fucked up, you know? <laughs> Okay, so you said I'm ugly. No, I'm not saying you're ugly. You said am I attracted to you? That's what you said, right? Yeah. Whoa, I swear something just moved right here. Damn. That shit backfired on DDG. He's supposed to be making Saluminati jealous and she straight up whoops smacked your ass and said, I ain't attracted to you, motherfucker. I ain't interested in you at all. So you can't even so you can't even get Illuminati jealous because she straight up said that she ain't attracted to you. Damn, that sucks. So, so you're not attracted to me is what you tell Damn. Not like that. I don't even know you. <laughs> we don't even know each other yet. Like, okay. we literally just linked and then we started making this video. This is the first time okay, we met. Okay, let me actually... But we're trying to mix the drama out, you know what I'm saying? At least lie. At least do it for the, for the theatrical, cinematic drama for all the fans and the internet, you know? Just Make it fun. What do you rate me from 1 to 10? Um... Yeah, do it. Well, you're not a 0 and you're not a 10. Oh! <laughs> what? That's, that's, the way she oh, says she, it, is though. That, is that mean? It was kind of I didn't tough. think so, because 0 is like ugly. Oh, it's just stupid. I hate rating. Take a good look. <laughs> Take a good look. I know what you look like. Right, you I, give him, I give DDG a 7 for looks. But it's gonna bump up to an eight for personality. No. Let me get off the No, you don't need to get off the Let me get off the So you can get a hold. Here, hold it for me. <laughs> and I don't and really. Before you rate me, because you ain't said you're not attracted to me. So. I don't really care too much about the style neither. He can wear some PJs, all that stuff. It's about it's all about your swag and how you carry yourself. Bam. Oh. <laughs> oh. Hey. He needs some milk. You done? See that right there? That was his swag. You know that pumped him up to a nine. <laughs> you get a good look. Uh huh. Look at the. That's dope. That's dope. Huh? Come on, man. <laughs> Rate me. I want to know. Okay. Um. Be honest, Ash. Eight. 
Eight. That's okay. good. That's a good number. <laughs> that's good. Well, that's because I'm nice. Because I know you <laughs> and like Come fucking Soldier Boy rated me, and they were like both below seven, which oh. is kind of on some hating ass shit. Cause you I see know. Damn. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But Damn. I've been doing a lot of work in the church, and it's like I'm not that petty. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. What did I rate you? I don't know, but I know they were both below seven. I'm like, oh, these things are cabbage. No, I did not think I rated you a ten, actually. No, you definitely did not. You didn't. I was definitely. In the I want to know. I didn't watch it. Compared to other people. Let us know what you rated her. Here nor there. Man, let me. I'm gonna go to the video because I don't like you just said that. Because I know I rated you a ten. Definitely didn't. I literally remember texting my best friend Ellie like, "Wow, these people like did this rating video and I was in it, and they rated me this." And she's like, wow, "They're such haters." I'm like, "Why are they coming after my life?" Ash is very pretty. I give Ash, I give Ash an eight for looks. Um, a nine for not necessarily personality, but her mental, like the way she thinks. But then she goes down to a fucking seven because she's she's cuckoo for cocoa puffs. Go ahead, Richie. Under, you said under a seven. Yeah, seven was definitely the highest. Uh, man, we give Ash like, oh my god. That's Ash. <laughs> what the fuck is? What do we have here? That's you politics you have to pay for now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna give those away freely anymore. <laughs> well, she got a boyfriend. Nah, I don't think so. See, I could rate her because I don't know her boyfriend. But look, though. Can we go down? What's up with her eyes in that last picture? She wears contacts a lot. Alright, I give her like a nine. Nine? Yeah, nine, like a, like a seven and a half. A eight, seven and a half? Like eight. Seven and a half, 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 eight. Seven it's not bad though. I don't know. That's well, not bad. Actually, it's up to perspective because some it people is. don't like tattoos. So right. Like, I, I didn't give you a seven. I don't know what I gave you. When it comes to attraction, everyone's rating of someone is going to be different for different reasons. Just because most people think this person is attractive doesn't mean I'm going to find them attractive. We just have different likes and different interests in people. But anyways, when it comes to rating, I want to know and this is and I want you guys to be honest like straight up I've never asked anyone to rate me okay I've never asked anyone because I don't really give a fuck I don't really care but you know what this got me curious I kind of want to know so please comment below from from 0 to 10 0 being the ugliest 10 being the most attractive and when I say attractive I don't mean looks like everything personality the way I think the way I speak uh, the way I look, so on and so forth. Comment below, let me know what your rating is of me. Thank you. Well, I'm still rating you. No, I didn't ask for my rate. You asked for your rate. I don't want to know what you rate me. Oh, uh, you don't want me to rate you? No, because I'm going to fight you. Like, shut the fuck up. I don't like, I don't take that type of criticism well in person. So don't rate me out. You, you want me to rate you? No, I don't. <laughs> it's not going to be a bad rate. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> I'm going to give you like a 12. Oh, no, thanks. Okay, 12, maybe 20. Shut up. 20, 20, shit. <laughs> this better not be on the 100 scale. <laughs> okay. It's not a 5. Shut up. Yeah. Okay. It's not a 5. Okay. <laughs> you look really He's nice. He's so today. stupid. Thanks. Really, really nice. Oh, the prank's thanks. gonna start. The thanks. prank's gonna begin. Yeah. Hey, I'm gonna pause it right there real quick. So if y'all have been seeing my videos lately, I have been uh, responding or answering questions of people who have been leaving comments on my videos. And I'm gonna go ahead and do that right now. Okay, so this comment right here is by Skyaticus. Okay, Skyaticus Jones. What's up, girl? I know you've been commenting a lot lately and I see you, trust me, I notice you. Okay, so. Her comment is, I'm curious to see what D looks like without weave and makeup. I'm sure that confidence would shrivel away, lol. I see you with the robe. You know what? <clears throat> I gotta agree with you. I have to agree with you. I've seen her without the makeup. She's okay. And especially when you take off the eyelashes. She's aight. So yes, I do believe Diera does look a lot better with makeup and when she's all dolled up. 
but most people do. We need some form of enhancement. That's just how the world works, you know what I'm saying? But thank you for commenting, girl. Now let's get back to the prank. I'm like super passionate about comfort. Mm -hmm. I focus on so too. I'm fucking with the purple. Purple nice. Thank you. Cute on you. I've never seen this before either. That's hard. I like that. Your makeup is absolutely impeccable <laughs> today. <laughs> Thanks. Everything. Everything. Yeah, everything is amazing. You just like, Thanks. I'm attracted to you. I'm not gonna lie to you. Oh my god. I'm oh. attracted to you. Oh my god. Can I tell you what I want to do? Do what? If if I can do anything in the world right now, what I want to do? Who even speaks like this, dude? <laughs> <laughs> okay, this ain't no skit. This is not a skit. The only reason why I know this is because I watch Ash a lot. I've been watching her from the very beginning. This is real. So it's better to always prank Ash on some real shit because Ash will give you her raw reaction. So let's continue watching. <laughs> Come back here. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> What? We're not even eating anymore. This isn't even a mukbang. Such a terrible video. <laughs> Listen. Oh. Uh, do it. Oh! The windows is tinted. <laughs> okay, that's not happening, first of all. And that's really weird to even ask while we're filming. <laughs> oh! <laughs> like, you want to get back to the video? This is so awkward. Dude, like, this has never happened to me in my life. I don't even know how to address this. <laughs> No! I don't even know how to address this. You guys have to, you, you have to understand that Ash d isn't really into the YouTube thing. Like, she has a YouTube channel and everything, but she doesn't really watch other YouTubers and what they do and what their content consists of. So, I'm pretty sure she hasn't really seen what DDG does on his channel. Oh! So she's really caught off guard. Is that normal for you? Yeah, all the time. Like, girls just meet you and they're like, yeah. I mean, I, I'm the one, I'll be telling girls no. Maybe want to, I tell them no. But you, I'm asking you, so you should do it. <laughs> <laughs> no, so you should do it. No. That's so weird. I like so, that. You know, you're the first girl that ever, 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 ever said they was unattractive to me. There's always time for a first. How did that make you feel? Oh! I don't know, that could be a lie. Mm. Mm. Anyways. What could be a lie? What are you talking about? <laughs> we gotta move from this spot in a minute, man. Move from what spot? Like the we gotta spot? move from this parking spot. So come back here so we can do it. Oh! <laughs> I'm not doing shit with you. Are you serious? I'm just trying to make a mukbang and you're making this not awkward. I love and I'm that. sorry nobody's ever told you that. That's like really hard to fathom, but... I love her reaction to it, okay? I love her response. She's got some self-worth. She has some self-respect. She lets you know what it is and we ain't playing no games. I ain't about to um, lead you on. This is what it is. And I'm gonna also tell you how crazy you sound. Wait, no. So, so you're telling me I got this card, all this jewelry and shit, and you telling me you're not gonna get back here and do it to me. Oh! Why the fuck would I do that? It's not my car, it's not my jewelry. The fuck? If you don't come on, man. Oh, shut the fuck up. <laughs> Yo. How the fuck did you get out of this? Oh! Somebody, oh! He needs oh. some milk! <laughs> Hold on, I'm gonna stop it right there, real quick. The only time that Ash does not have does not have self-respect is when she's in love. With any man she's with, whoever she's in love with, she lets her she lets them treat her like shit, step all over her, take advantage of her. That's the only problem she has. But if she ain't in love with you, bye. Where did she go? Damn, this girl ran. And she's short. She's a little one. So her little legs went. 
What's the deal? What's wrong? There she is. What's, I was, it's a prank. Listen, listen, it's a prank. It's a prank. Oh, okay. You, did you scratch my car? I don't know. It's a prank. Mm -hmm. I'm just playing. Look, okay. the camera on. I'm just playing. I promise I'm just playing. Okay, I get it because you're a YouTuber and that's what YouTubers do. I'm not a YouTuber, <laughs> sweetheart. I'm a rapper. Oh! <laughs> but yeah. Slash YouTuber pranks. <laughs> Give me a hug. No, I need that pill for my anxiety. That is so difficult. Just Give me a hug. Come on. <laughs> I'm my back when you hug me. <laughs> hey, you, gotta, yeah, real you gotta let them know. It's a prank. Okay. What am I supposed to be like, yay? <laughs> it's a prank, don't worry. Did you, did you still wanna go or not? Yeah. If y'all enjoyed that video, make sure you do me a favor and smash the like button. Just cut another W. Oh man. That was That's good. Crazy. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. Go that check out Ash's channel. Appreciate you tuning in. I love y'all niggas. See you next time. Let's get it. Since you got some Rex, but it's really That was a good prank. Uh, DDG, you did a great job. Uh, I really wish kind of that Ash uh, just said that you were a 10 or something just to piss off Illuminati. But regardless, this collab is going to piss him off anyways. So come on, Illuminati man. Come on, so. Come out with the video. All right, you guys. Don't forget to rate me in the comments below, okay? I really wanna see. All right, make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe, and please hit the bell so you can get notified every time I upload. See you in the next video. Peace.